The Father, we adore you. Dieu le Père, nous t'adorons. God the Son, we adore you. Dieu le Fils, nous t'adorons. Holy Spirit, we adore you. Saint-Esprit, nous t'adorons. We lay our lives before you. Nous plaçons nos vies devant toi. We adore you, Jesus. Nous t'adorons, Jésus. We give you praise. Selon la louange. The Bishop of our soul. L'évêque de nos âmes. The Lover of our soul. L'amoureux de nos âmes. The Glory and the Lifter up of la our hearts. L'Amour élévateur de nos têtes. Our Ebenezer. Notre Ebenezer. Our Ebenezer. Notre Ebenezer. Our Ever-Present Help. Notre aide toujours présent. Failing God. Le Dieu qui ne faillit jamais. Unchanging God. God. Le Dieu qui ne change jamais. Immovable God. Le Dieu qui ne se meut pas. Faithful God. Le Dieu fidèle. Dependable God. Le Dieu sûr. Reliable Le God. Le Dieu fiable. Everlasting God. Le Dieu éternel. Our ever present Notre help. Notre aide toujours présent. Our help in ages Notre past. Notre aide dans les années passées. Our hope for years to Notre come. Notre espoir dans les We années à venir. Glory. Nous donnons la gloire. Blessed be your Béni soit ton nom. Please accept our worship. Accepte notre adoration. In the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. And as we go into your word. Comme nous entrons dans ta parole. Please speak to us again. S'il te plaît, parle-nous. Change us with your word. Change-nous avec ta parole. Challenge us with your word. Défie-nous avec ta parole. Encourage us with your word. Encourage-nous avec ta parole. Correct us with your word. Correct-nous avec ta parole. Bless us with your word. Bénis-nous avec ta parole. In the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. Let the entrance of your word. Que l'entrée de ta parole. Bring light to our hearts. Apporte la lumière à nos cœurs. In the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. Thank you, our Father. Merci, notre Père. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. Praise the Lord. Alleluia. I know you have greeted your neighbor. Je sais que vous avez salué votre voisin. One more time, give that your neighbor a big smile. Souris à votre voisin. A big smile and tell him, oh, you are welcome. Dites-le, tu es bienvenu. You are welcome. In the name of Jesus, I love you. You are my brother. You are my sister. Tu es mon frère. Tu es ma sœur. I love you with the love of God. De l'amour du Seigneur. Glory be to God. Gloire à Dieu. Thank you, Jesus. Merci, Jésus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Once again, we are welcome. Nous sommes encore bienvenus into the house dans la maison and into the presence of our et dans la présence de notre Père, great and mighty God. le grand et puissant Dieu. We give him praise. Nous donnons la louange. Hallelujah. Amen. We want to thank God for last week's Sunday. Nous voulons dire merci à Dieu pour dimanche the dernier. International day. De la journée internationale. It was, it was glorious. C'était, c'était glorieux. And we give God praise. Nous donnons la louange à Dieu. We would like to use this opportunity to those who brought to thank those who brought their dishes the dishes Alors, from their nations merci à tous ceux qui ont apporté quelque chose de those leur nation those dishes were very very ces repas étaient très sweet. très bons hallelujah bon. amen we bless god it's as if we should be having international day every sunday c'est comme si on doit avoir journée internationale tous les dimanches hallelujah amen glory be to god gloire à dieu james chapter 5 jacques chapitre 5 from verse 13 du to 18 verset 13 à 18 james 5 jacques 5 13 to 18. Verset 13 à 18. If you are not there, say, Pastor, I am still searching. Si vous n'êtes pas dit, Pastor, je cherche encore. <laughs> James 5, 13 to 18. Jacques 5, 13 à 14. Is anyone among you suffering? Let him pray. Is anyone cheerful? Let him sing psalms. Is anyone among you sick? Let him call for the elders of the church and let them pray over him, anointing him with oil in the name of the Lord. And the prayer of faith will save the sick and the Lord will raise him up. And if he has committed sins, he will be forgiven. Before we go on, I'd like to pray one prayer very quickly. Je veux prier une prière rapidement. There's anyone here S'il y a quelqu'un ici who is sick, qui est malade, Bible says we should pray. Eh bien, nous devons prier. And particularly if that person has committed any sin. Et si cette personne a commis un péché. And that sickness came as a result of sin. Et la maladie est venue à cause du péché. That God will forgive him. Que Dieu lui pardonnera. I pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Je prie Christ. au nom de Jésus. If you are sick in this place. Si tu es malade dans ce lieu. The Lord will heal you. Le Seigneur te guérira. In the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. And if that sickness came as a result of a sin you si committed. Si cette maladie est venue à cause d'un péché que tu as commis. The Lord forgives you in the name of Jesus. Le Seigneur te pardonne au nom de Jésus. Confess your trespasses passes to one another and pray for one another that you may be healed the effective fervent prayer of a righteous man avails much elijah was a man with a nature like ours and he prayed earnestly that it would not rain and it did not rain on the land for three years and six months and he prayed again and the heaven gave rain and the earth produced its fruits Today we are sharing on the topic. Aujourd'hui on partage sur Lord make me a man of prayer. 
Seigneur, fais de moi un homme de prière. Or if you are a woman, Lord, make me a woman of prayer. Alors si tu es une femme, Seigneur, fais de moi une femme de prière. Lord, make me a man or a woman of prayer. Seigneur, fais de moi un homme ou une femme de prière. It's a very important uh, topic. C'est un sujet important. And that topic alone is even a prayer itself. Et même ce sujet est une prière en elle-même. And if you pray that prayer sincerely from your heart, et si tu as prié cette prière sincèrement dans ton cœur, the Lord will answer it in Jesus' name. Le Seigneur va l'exaucer au nom de Jésus. I will see why it's very important. Et on verra pourquoi c'est important. What is prayer? Qu'est-ce que la prière? Prayer is the link between man and God is maker. La prière est le lien entre l'homme et Dieu son créateur. The link between man and God his maker. C'est le lien entre Dieu et l'homme son créateur et Prayer Dieu son créateur. Is communion between man and God. La prière est la communion entre l'homme et Dieu. Prayer is a source of fellowship with God. La prière est une source de communion avec Dieu. When we pray we are having fellowship with God. Lorsqu'on prie on a la communion avec Dieu. Prayer is a source of spiritual nourishment. La prière est une source de nourriture spirituelle. For the children of God. Pour les enfants de Dieu. It's a source of spiritual nourishment. C'est une source de nourriture spirituelle. When we pray, lorsqu'on prie, we are receiving, we are having fellowship with God. Nous avons une communion avec Dieu. And we are receiving spiritual nourishment from Him. Et nous recevons him. de la nourriture spirituelle de lui. I know everybody, every human being has needs. Je sais que tout être humain a des besoins. Is there somebody here who doesn't have a need? You are settled. You are okay. Completely okay. Il est complètement Spiritually, d'accord. everywhere. Spiritually, partout, tout va bien. Everybody has needs. Tout le monde a des besoins. And one of the ways. Et un des moyens. By which we present our needs to God. Par lesquels nous présentons nos besoins à Dieu. Is through prayers. C'est au travers de la prière. When we pray, we present our petitions before Him. Lorsque nous prions, him. nous présentons nos requêtes we devant lui. We present our needs to Him. Nous présentons nos besoins. Prayer is a way of entering into God's presence. La prière est un moyen d'entrer dans la présence de Dieu. With our requests, our petitions and our thanksgiving. Avec nos demandes, nos pétitions et nos actions de grâce. It's a way of entering into God's presence. C'est un moyen d'entrer dans la présence de Dieu. With our requests, avec nos pétitions. Our petitions and our thanksgiving. Et notre de grâce. Hallelujah. Amen. When we pray, lorsque nous prions, God listens. Dieu écoute. He hears us. Il nous entend. He also speaks to our spirits. Il parle aussi à notre esprit. So we see that prayer is a two-way affair. Alors on voit que la prière est une, est une chose de personne. to God. Lorsqu'on parle à Dieu, God speaks to our spirits. Dieu parle à notre esprit. And then He answers our prayers. Et après il exauce nos according prières. According to His divine will. Selon sa volonté divine. He answers according to His divine will. Il répond selon sa volonté divine. That's why sometimes you ask some things from God. Alors parfois on demande quelque chose à Dieu. And if it is not the will of God for your life, He may not give it. Et ce n'est pas la volonté de Dieu, il ne te donnera pas. God has the prerogative of everything. Dieu a la prerogative sur toutes choses. He has the final say in everything. Il a le dernier mot en toute chose. So he answers our prayers. Il exauce nos prières. According to his divine selon will. Selon sa volonté. At least from what we have said so far. Alors de ce qu'on a dit jusqu'à maintenant. We see that prayer is very very critical. On voit que la prière est très très importante. Especially for a Christian. Spécialement pour un chrétien. For a child of God, prayer is Pour un enfant everything. de Dieu, la prière est toute chose. As a matter of fact, I see prayer as more or less our life. En fait, je vois la prière comme plus ou moins notre vie. There is no way a child of God can successfully traverse this world without prayer. Un enfant ne peut pas traverser ce monde sans la prière. Prayer is more or less like our lifeline. La prière est plus ou moins notre direction what, de vie. What connects our life to God? Ce qui connecte notre vie à and Dieu. And what connects God to our life? Et ce qui connecte Dieu à notre vie. Is prayer. C'est la prière. It becomes very important therefore. Ça devient très important alors. That we should be men and women of prayer. Nous devons être des hommes et des femmes de prière. Is so important. La prière est très importante. His prayer is our lifeline. La prière est notre vie. His prayer is the way by which we have communion and we receive from God. Si la prière est le moyen par lequel nous avons la communion et recevons de Dieu. It becomes very important, therefore, that you and I must be men and women of prayer. Ça devient très important que vous et moi soyons des hommes et des femmes. Brothers and sisters, frères et sœurs, I like to submit to you. Je voudrais vous dire ceci. That a prayerless Christian, que un chrétien qui ne prie pas, is a miserable Christian. C'est un chrétien misérable. A prayerless Christian, un chrétien qui ne prie pas, is a miserable Christian. Chrétien misérable. A prayerless Christian un chrétien qui ne will be pas, at the mercy of the devil. Sera à la merci du diable. He will be at the mercy of the wicked one. Il sera à la merci du méchant. The devil will mess up the life of a prayerless Le Christian. Le diable va gâcher la vie d'un chrétien qui ne prie he pas. He will do whatever he wants to do Il with that person's life. Il fera ce qu'il veut faire avec la vie de cette personne. And I like to give you just one scripture to support to support that. Je vais vous donner un passage pour supporter ce que je Jesus dis. Jesus said to his disciples. Jésus a dit à ses disciples. In Matthew 26. Dans Matthieu 26. Verse 41. Verset 41. Matthieu 26. Matthieu 26 verse 21 verse 41 beg your pardon Jesus said Jésus a dit Watch and pray 
Veillez et priez. Lest you enter into temptation. Que vous ne vous trouvez dans la tentation. Watch and pray. Veillez et priez. So that you will not enter into temptation. Que vous n'entrez pas dans la tentation. You and I don't know that every day. Alors vous savez vous et moi que tous les jours. We are faced with all manners of temptation. Nous avons faisons face à tout genre de tentation. All kinds of temptation come our way. Tout genre de tentation vient sur notre chemin. On a daily basis. Tous les jours. Temptation to disobey God. La tentation de désobéir à Dieu. Temptation to sin. De pécher. Temptation to go against the will of God. Tentation d'aller contre la volonté de Dieu. Temptation all the time. Tentation tout le temps. Temptation to do what is contrary to the word and the will of God. Tentation à contraire à la volonté we de Dieu. We are faced with temptation every day. Nous sommes face à la tentation tous les and jours. And I can tell you, beloved. Et je peux vous dire bien aimé. That the ultimate aim of temptation. Que le but ultime de la tentation. Is to put us in trouble with God. De nous mettre dans les problèmes avec Dieu. Any time Satan brings temptation your way. Chaque fois où Satan apporte la tentation sur votre it chemin. It is to put you in trouble with God. C'est pour vous mettre les problèmes avec when Dieu. the devil tells you to do what is contrary to the will of God. Quand le diable te demande de faire ce qui est contraire à la volonté de Dieu. It is because he wants to put you in trouble with God. C'est parce qu'il veut te mettre dans les problèmes avec Dieu. When the devil tells you to disobey God. Quand le diable te demande de désobéir à Dieu. It is because he wants to break the fellowship between you and God. C'est parce qu'il veut briser la communion entre Dieu et toi. To put you in trouble. Pour te mettre dans les problèmes. With God. Avec Dieu. And if you, Jesus Christ was telling his disciples. Et Jésus disait à ses disciples. If you want to avoid that. Si tu veux que cela n'arrive pas. You want to avoid Avoid being in trouble with God. Si tu veux pas être dans les problèmes avec Jesus Dieu. said, "Watch and pray." Jésus a dit, "Veille et prie." So that you don't fall into temptation. Pour que tu ne tombes pas dans la tentation. And you don't enter into trouble with God. Que tu ne tombes pas dans les problèmes avec Dieu. I pray that none of us. Je prie qu'aucun d'entre nous. Will fall to the temptation of the wicked one. Ne tombe dans la tentation du méchant. In the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. Every day when you go out, temptation everywhere. Tous les jours quand tu sors la tentation partout. As a man, temptation everywhere. En tant que homme, tentation. As a young lady, temptation everywhere. En tant que jeune femme, tentation partout. None of us will fall. Nous n'allons pas tomber dedans. In the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ. I also like to remind you Je aussi nous rappeler of our slogan in this church, Victory House. Notre slogan dans cette église, I'm sure we all know it. Prayer changes things. La prière change les choses. That thing, that, that statement came from experience. Alors ce commentaire est venu par expérience. We know that prayer changes things. Nous savons que la prière change les choses. Something is bad. Si quelque chose est mauvais. And you want it to be good. Et tu veux que ce soit bien. Prayer can change it. La prière peut le changer. There's no situation that prayer cannot change. Il n'y a pas de situation que la prière ne puisse changer. It changes lives. Ça change les vies. And it changes situations. Ça change les situations. We have seen people whose lives were miserable, On bad. On a vu les gens dont la vie était misérable. We have seen people who didn't have any hope. On a vu les gens qui n'avaient pas d'espoir. But prayer changed their lives Mais and they became people of substance. Mais la prière a changé leur vie et sont devenus les personnes de substance. We have seen people that were dying. On a vu des gens qui mouraient. Situations that looked irredeemable. Les situations qui semblaient irrationnelles. And prayer changed it and they are living and they are well. Et la prière a changé, ils vivent et ils sont bons. Prayer changes things. La prière change les choses. It changes lives. Ça change les vies. And it changes situations. Ça change les situations. What we want to do today Ce qu'on veut faire aujourd'hui is to look at the lives of some people. C'est de regarder la vie de certaines personnes. You know, the Bible says the, the scripture is written for our admonition. La Bible a été écrite pour notre we want to look at the lives of some people. On regarder la vie de certaines Men personnes. Men and women of prayer. Les hommes et les femmes de prière. People who prayed. Les gens qui ont prié. I want to learn from their experiences. Ils vont apprendre de leur expérience. I want to believe that what we are about to share today. Alors je crois que ce qu'on va partager aujourd'hui will change the attitude and the perspective of some of us. Va changer l'attitude de perspective de certains prayer sous la prière. Those of us who have been weak in the place of prayer. Pour ceux qui sont faibles dans la prière. Those of us who have been not been taking prayer seriously. Pour ceux qui ne prennent pas la prière au sérieux. By the time we finish in the next few minutes. Quand on finira dans les prochaines minutes. I want to believe that some of our attitude will change. Je veux croire que notre attitude va changer. I like to begin with a man called Nehemiah. Avec Nehemiah. 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 In Nehemiah chapter one. Dans Nehemiah chapitre un. From verse two to verse three. Du verset deux à trois. Nehemiah chapter one. Nehemiah un. Verses two and three. Nehemiah received some unpleasant news. Nehemiah reçu de mauvaises nouvelles. Some bad news. Des mauvaises nouvelles. About the situation in Jerusalem. La situation à Jérusalem. Very terrible news about what was happening there. Alors mauvaise nouvelle ce qui arrivait là-bas. People were living in a very bad situation. Les gens étaient dans une mauvaise situation. The wall of Jerusalem had been broken down and burnt. Les murs de Jéricho ont été renversés et brûlés. Things were so bad back home. Les choses étaient très mauvaises. Meanwhile, Nehemiah was in a foreign land. Nehemiah était dans un pays étranger. When that news came to him, quand cette nouvelle lui est parvenue, it was so bad that this man broke down and wept. Alors c'était tellement mal que il s'est il est tombé et il a pleuré. He broke down and he started to weep when he heard of the situation at home. Il a commencé à pleurer quand il a entendu la situation. Just like some of you, when you hear about what is happening to your parents, to your brothers and sisters at home. C'est entre vous quand vous entendez ce qui arrive à vos parents à la maison. Your heart is broken and you begin to cry. Votre cœur est brisé, vous commencez à pleurer. You begin to weep. Vous commencez à pleurer. But weeping and crying. 
Mais les pleurs will not change anything. ne changent rien du It tout. Won't change any situation. Ça ne change rien du tout. It can only add to the problem. Ça ajoute seulement au problème. Because as you are crying and weeping, Parce que comme tu pleures if you are not careful, you yourself, you can get sick. Tu vas devenir malade, tu vas tomber malade. So I don't have any problem. I mean, because of the emotion. Alors à cause des émotions. Because we are emotional people. Parce que nous sommes des personnes émotionnelles. When you hear some bad news, yes, there's nothing wrong about crying and weeping over them. I Alors, don't have any problem with that. Il n'y a rien de mal à pleurer et se lamenter. But you shouldn't continue like that. Mais tu ne pas continuer comme ça. Let's learn from Nehemiah. Apprenons de Nehemiah. After weeping and praying for some time. Après qu'il ait pleuré Nehemiah pendant un temps. Nehemiah decided to change, you know, the whole thing. Nehemiah décidé de changer la situation. He decided to take action. Il a décidé de prendre action. And what did he do? Et qu'est-ce qu'il a he fait? He went into fasting and praying. Il est dans la prière et le jeûne. I have cried enough concerning this. Matter. Alors je suis je, je vous dis ceci j'ai assez pleuré concernant ce matter. Crying is not going to help me. Les pleurs ne vont pas m'aider. Let me do what is right. Que je fasse ce qui so est juste. So he went to fasting and pray. Il est dans la prière et le jeûne. If you look at verse 4. Si tu regardes le verset 4. chapter 1 verse 4. Il a mis un verset 4. He said that he did this for many days. Il a fait cela pendant plusieurs jours. The fasting and praying. La, la prière et le jeûne. He did it for many days. Il a fait pendant plusieurs jours. So I like to let you know, beloved. Alors je vous fais savoir, bien aimé. Sometimes you may need to pray concerning a particular issue for many days. Parfois, on peut prier pour une chose pendant plusieurs jours. Some of us have been prayed once. Certains prient une fois. Or have been prayed maybe one or two times. Ou une fois ou deux fois. And you don't get results. On n'a pas de résultat. You begin to think that God does not want to answer. On pense que Dieu ne veut pas exaucer. Sometimes you need to pray for many days. Parfois, il faut prier pendant plusieurs jours. This man prayed for many days. Cet homme a prié pendant plusieurs In jours. Six, Au verset 6. He said he did it day and night. Il dit qu'il a fait jour et nuit. As he was praying during the day. Comme il priait en journée. He was praying during the night. Il priait la nuit. I like to announce to you, beloved brothers and sisters. Bien aimé, frères et sœurs. Sometimes you need to wake up in the middle of the night to pray concerning some issues. Parfois, il faut se réveiller la nuit pour prier sur certains sujets. I have said to you several times in this place. Je vous l'ai dit plusieurs fois dans ce lieu. If every night you sleep throughout the night. Si chaque nuit tu dors toute la nuit. There is no time at all that you wake up in the middle of the night to pray. Tu te lèves pas la nuit pour prier. You are praying with fire. Tu joues avec le feu. Because the enemy that you are dealing with doesn't sleep. Parce que l'ennemi avec lequel tu joues ne dort pas. He is always walking up and down looking for who to destroy. Il marche ici et là pour chercher qui dévorer. So while you are sleeping and snoring, pendant que tu dors et tu ronfles, the devil is at work. Le diable est à l'œuvre. He is trying to oppress you. He is trying to defeat you. Il essaie de te vaincre. And you, you are sleeping. Et toi, tu dors. If your enemy is not sleeping, why should you be sleeping? Ne dors pas. Pourquoi toi, tu dors? So Nehemiah prayed. Alors Nehemiah a prié. He prayed for many days. Il a prié pendant plusieurs jours. He prayed during the day. Il a prié en journée. Et il a prié la nuit. That's a challenge for you and I. C'est un défi pour vous et moi. Those of us who have not been praying in the day. Pour ceux qui ne prient pas en journée. Let them know praying during the night. Qui prient au moins la nuit. Some people don't even pray during the day. Les gens ne prient pas le jour. How do you expect them to pray in the night? Comment vont-ils prier la nuit? Prayer is very key. La prière est la clé. For you to have solution to those problems. Pour avoir la solution à vos problèmes. So there was a problem. Alors il y avait un problème. And Nehemiah went into action. Et Nehemiah allait dans l'action. And I'm pleased to announce that there was a result. Et je veux vous annoncer qu'il y a eu un résultat. The Bible says the effectual fervent prayer of a righteous man. La prière fait vente du juste. Abaisse moi. À l'efficacité. When you pray the way you are supposed to pray, the results will come. Le résultat viendra. And if you read, if you study the rest of the book of Nehemiah, si le reste du livre de Néhémie, you will see that this man achieved results. Tu vois que cet homme a accompli des résultats. Number one, the first thing that happened. La première chose qui est arrivée. Was that the wall of Jerusalem that was broken down? Le mur de Jéricho qui était tombé. The wall that was burnt. Les murs qui ont été brûlés. That wall, they succeeded in building it again. Ils ont réussi à rebâtir le mur. Another thing that happened. Une autre chose qui s'est produite. There were so many opponents. There were so many enemies. Et beaucoup d'ennemis. To the work. Au travail. But they were defeated. Mais ils ont été vaincus. God made sure that all the enemies of the project were defeated. And then number three. Et la troisième chose. There was revival among the people. Il y a eu un réveil parmi le peuple. You know when 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 people go through a lot of stress, a lot of problems. Lorsque les gens passent par beaucoup de stress, c'est des problèmes. It is enough to demoralize them. Ils sont démoralisés. So when the things were going wrong in Jerusalem. Mais quand tout n'allait pas à Jérusalem. People became a lot demoralized. Les gens étaient démoralisés. But as a result of this man's prayer. Mais à cause de la prière de Nehemiah. There was revival in Jerusalem. Il y a eu un réveil à Jérusalem. People became revived again. Les gens étaient réveillés. And people started worshiping God again. Les gens ont commencé à adorer Dieu encore. So you see at least three results. On voit au moins trois résultats. Why? Because one man prayed. Parce que un homme a prié. One man prayed. Un homme a prié. And so many things happened. Et beaucoup de choses sont passées. The Bible says one shall chase a thousand. Mais il dit que un va chasser mille. But two shall put two thousand to flight. Mais deux vont chasser dix mille. So when one man prays, mais lorsqu'un homme prie, there is results. Il y a des résultats. Can you imagine when we gather together like this? Imaginez qu'on se met ensemble. The kind of results that we can get. Le genre de résultats qu'on peut avoir. So when you pray, alors lorsqu'on prie, there are results. Il y a des résultats. 
I don't know if you are like Nehemiah here. Je si tu es comme Nehemiah ici. And you have received some bad news. Et tu as reçu de mauvaises nouvelles. And you have wept and you have cried Et over it. Et tu as pleuré it. sur ce sur, I'm, sur I'm cela. I'm announcing to you it's time to take action. Alors je vous annonce le temps de it's prendre action. It's time to take that matter to God in prayer. Et de mener la chose à la prière de Dieu. And in the mighty name of Jesus. Et au nom puissant de Jésus. The Lord that gave result to Nehemiah. Le Seigneur qui a donné résultat à Nehemiah. He will give you result in Jesus' name. Te donnera des résultats au nom de Jésus. As you take those matters to God in prayer. Quand tu amènes cela à Dieu devant la prière. You will see results. Tu auras des résultats. In the mighty name of Jesus. Au nom puissant de Jésus. So Nehemiah was a man of prayer. Nehemiah était un homme de prière. And we see the result of his prayer. Et on a vu les résultats de sa prière. Another man of prayer. Un autre homme de prière. Was Daniel. C'est Daniel. Daniel was a man of prayer. Daniel était un homme de prière. In Daniel chapter six. Daniel chapitre six. We see that there was a plot. On voit qu'il y avait un complot. Il y avait un complot. Against Daniel. Contre Daniel. It was not low level conspiracy at all. C'était pas un bas niveau. It was a high level conspiracy. C'était un complot à une très grande, un très grand niveau. Sealed and delivered. Qui a été qui a été scellé. High level conspiracy against this man. Un complot à un très haut niveau. Can we read Daniel chapter six verse ten? Lisons Daniel six verset dix. Daniel chapter six verse ten. Daniel six verset dix. Thank you Jesus. Merci Jésus. Daniel six ten. Now when they knew that the writing was signed, he went home. Now when Daniel knew that the writing was signed, he went home. And in his upper room, with his windows open toward Jerusalem, he knelt down on his knees three times that day. And he prayed and gave thanks before his God, as was his custom since early days. There are a few things, two or three things I want to bring from that passage. Alors, il y a, il y a deux ou trois choses que je veux sortir de ce passage. So, we, uh, from, from verse one, we read that there was there was a high level conspiracy against this man. À, à partir du verset un, on voit qu'il y avait une grande, il y a un grand complot. But the Bible told us la Bible nous a dit that Daniel decided to pray. Daniel a décidé de prier. And he prayed three times a day. Il a prié trois fois par jour. The first question I want to ask you is. La première question que je vais vous poser. How est often do you pray? Alors comment est-ce que vous priez? Even in a day. Même en une journée. How often do you pray? Combien de fois priez? Some of us wake up in the in the morning. Certains se réveillent le matin. We, we, you know, maybe because you are watching a movie till late in the night. Peut-être parce qu'on regardait un film tard la nuit. And then you wake up late in the morning. On se réveille tard. And then you look at the time. Man, on my metro. Le... If I don't catch this metro Et now. Si je n'attrape pas ce métro so, maintenant. Brr, 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 you just rush out of the house. On se lève rapidement sans de la maison. To even thank God for waking you up that day. Même de dire merci à Dieu de m'avoir réveillé. Listen to what the Bible says. The Bible, Bible says this man knelt and prayed and gave thanks. Et ben dit que Daniel a dit merci. I like you to know that thanksgiving is a form of prayer. L'action de grâce est une forme de prière. Thanksgiving is a form of prayer. C'est une forme de prière. And thank God for the Sunday school of today. Et merci à Dieu pour les cours d'aujourd'hui. Those of you who are not in Sunday school, you miss. Vous avez raté pour vous qui n'étiez pas là. Thanksgiving is a form of prayer. L'action de grâce est une forme de prière. So this man knelt down one day alone three times to pray. Alors cet homme se mettait à genoux trois fois par jour pour prier. You can pray as many times as possible in a day. Tu peux prier autant de fois que possible en une journée. You pray in the morning, you pray in the afternoon, you pray in the night. Tu pries l'après midi, tu pries le soir. You pray at home, you pray outside the home. Tu pries à la maison, tu pries hors de la maison. And that's why I always encourage you. Be a man that is able to pray in the spirit. Alors je vous encourage à être un homme à de prière dans l'esprit. If you cannot, if you cannot speak in tongues, if you cannot pray in the spirit, the devil is cheating you. Si tu peux prier en langue, alors le diable te vole. Because you need to pray all manners of prayers. Parce que tu dois prier tout genre de prières. And you need to pray at all times. Et tu dois prier à tout moment. You may be at work doing your work and you are praying. Tu peux être au travail, en train de travailler et tu pries. How many of us know that when you are singing melody unto the Lord, you are praying? Quand tu chantes une mélodie au Seigneur, tu pries. When you are singing praises unto the Lord, you are praying. Quand tu chantes des louanges au Seigneur, tu pries. So every moment of the day you are praying. Alors à tout moment de la journée tu pries. So this man on the, on, in one day alone three times he Cet prayed. Un jour, il priait trois fois. And he gave thanks to God. Il a dit merci à But Dieu. But the most important point I want to bring from that passage. Mais la chose importante de ce the passage. The Bible says as was his custom since early days. Il dit que c'est comme ça qu'il faisait depuis ses plus petits as jours. As was his custom. Comme c'est son habitude. So prayer had become a custom to la Daniel. La prière une habitude pour Daniel. It was a custom. C'était une habitude. Since early days, depuis ses petits since jours, he was young, depuis qu'il était he jeune, was a man of prayer. il était un homme de prière. And that he grew with it. Et il a grandi avec so, cela. If you want to know anything about Daniel, si tu veux savoir des choses sur Daniel, if something has become your custom, it's something that everybody knows about you. Alors c'est quelque chose que tout le monde sait de toi. In fact, if you read that Bible passage, uh, Daniel chapter six, si on lit Daniel six, somewhere in the earlier verse. The, the, the reason they, they said nobody should pray. Alors la raison pour laquelle on a dit que personne ne prie. Was because they want to implicate Daniel. C'est parce qu'on voulait impliquer Daniel. And then, the Bible says they look for everything that they could use to nail this guy. Ils avaient dit qu'ils ont cherché tout pour crucifier cet homme. They couldn't find any fault. Ils n'ont pu rien trouver. They couldn't find anything against him. Ils n'ont pas pu trouver quelque chose contre lui. They knew that the only way that we can catch this man. Ils savaient que la seule manière de le battre. Is when we say nobody should pray. C'est quand on dit que personne ne prie. They knew him. Ils le connaissaient. What do people know you for? Qu'est-ce que les gens vous savent? What is your own custom? Que savent les gens sur vous? Pray 
prayer was was, David, was Daniel's custom. La prière était l'habitude de Daniel. As, he, as was his custom. Comme était son What habitude. is your own custom? Quelle est votre habitude? Some people's custom is gossip. Alors les gens leur habitude c'est le commérage. Some people's commérage. custom is, is sleeping. Pour certains c'est le sommeil. Some people's custom is eating. Pour certains c'est la nourriture. They don't know anything than to eat and we are going to see that very soon. On va voir cela très bientôt. What do people know you for? Alors qu'est-ce que les gens te What connaissent? What is your own custom? Quelle est ton habitude? Like Daniel. Comme Daniel. Prayer should be your custom and my custom. La prière doit être ton habitude et la mienne. We must be people of prayer. Nous devons être des gens de prière. We must be men and women of prayer. Nous devons être des hommes et les femmes de prière. Without prayer, there's no way we can survive. Sans la prière, on ne peut pas réussir. We must be people of prayer. Nous devons être des gens de prière. And there was results. Et il y a eu des résultats. The people that conspired against him. Les gens qui ont conspiré contre lui. They were powerful, powerful people, people in the kingdom. Contre lui, c'est des personnes puissantes. Powerful people. Des personnes puissantes. People that were close to the king. Les gens qui étaient proches du roi. They were so close to the king. They were able to influence the king against Daniel. Ils ont pu influencer le roi contre Daniel. But when Daniel prayed, but after Daniel a prayed, there was result. Il y a eu résultat. If you read from verse 18 to 24, verse 18 to 24, Daniel 6 to 18 to 24, Daniel 6 to 18 to 24, you will see that God delivered Daniel from the conspiracy. Dieu a délivré Daniel du complot. God delivered him. Dieu l'a délivré. Maybe you are here. Peut-être tu es ici. And you are a victim of conspiracy. Et tu es victime d'un complot. Conspiracy in your family. Un complot dans ta conspiracy famille. Conspiracy in your place of work. Un complot au travail. People that are close to the boss. Les gens qui sont proches du patron. They are conspiring against you. Ils complotent contre toi. People that are more powerful than you. Les gens qui sont plus they puissants que toi. They are conspiring against you. Ils conspirent contre toi. I pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Au nom de Jésus. Some people are just jealous of you. Les gens sont jaloux de toi. And they want your destruction. Et ils veulent ta destruction. The Lord will deliver you from their hands. Le Seigneur te délivre de leurs mains. The Lord who delivered Daniel, Daniel from the hand of his conspirators, de la main des he will deliver you il va vous te délivrer. in the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. Look at verse 24. Verset 24. Daniel chapter 6, Daniel 6 verse 24. 24. Oh, I love this. Thank you, Jesus. Daniel 6, 24. Daniel and 6, the 24. king gave the command and they brought those men who had accused Daniel and they cast them into the den of lions. Them, their children, their wives, and the lions overpowered them and broke all their bones in pieces before they even came to the bottom of the den. This is what will happen to your enemies in Jesus' name. Ce qui arrive à tes ennemis au nom de Jésus. The Bible says all those who conspired against him. Ça veut dire que tous ceux qui ont comploté contre lui. The king, when he saw that God delivered Daniel. Lorsque le roi a vu que Dieu a délivré Daniel. He gave an order. All of you who have spoken lie against this man. Vous tous qui avez accusé cet homme. The, 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 the people themselves. Les gens mais eux-mêmes. Their wives. Leurs femmes. Their children. Leurs enfants. Gather everybody together. Mettez tout le monde ensemble. Go and put them inside the den. Mettez dans le den la fosse aux lions. And you know the lions were already hungry. Et les lions avaient faim. So the moment they were coming down. Alors, quand ils the tomber, lion became a goalkeeper. Les, les lions sont devenus he des went for them in the air. Ils sont allés dans les Even airs. before they landed on the ground. Avant qu'ils tombent au sol. They were already having a feast. Ils mangeaient des I avec pray in the name of Jesus. Je prie au nom all de those Jésus. who conspire against you. Tous ceux qui all those who you. lie against you. Tous ceux qui all accusent. those who are jealous of your progress. Jealous of your beauty. Jealous of what God is doing in your life. God will package every one of them together. They will be food for the devil in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. So we've seen two men who, who, who are men of prayers. On voit deux hommes qui étaient des hommes de prière. Like us to see two women to balance the equation. Alors voyons aussi deux femmes. Two women very quickly. Deux femmes rapidement. Hallelujah. Amen. The first one is found in Matthew chapter 15. La première est dans Matthieu Matthew chapter 15. 15. Matthew 15. From verse 21 to 28. Verse 21 to 28. Matthew 15, 21 to 28. Matthew 15, 21 to 28. Bible talks about a woman of Canaan. Et parle d'une femme de Canaan who approached Jesus, qui est venue vers Jésus and she was praying for the healing of her daughter. Elle priait pour la guérison de sa fille. And she met a lot of opposition. Elle a rencontré beaucoup d'opposition. Met a lot of opposition. Beaucoup d'opposition. No, the first thing that happened. La première chose qui s'est produite. The Bible says Jesus did not listen to her. Jésus l'a pas écouté. Jesus ignored her. Jésus l'a ignoré. As if she wasn't existing at Comme all. Comme si elle pas du tout. Do you know there are sometimes when you pray? Parfois il y a des moments où tu pries. And it's as if God is not hearing you. Et c'est comme si Dieu ne t'entend pas. God is not listening to you. Dieu ne t'écoute pas. You pray and pray, it's as if God is not hearing what tu you are saying. Tu pries, c'est comme si Dieu ne t'écoute pas. This woman made that kind of opposition. Cette femme a eu ce genre d'opposition. That was not all. C'était pas tout. The disciples said to Jesus. Jésus a dit à Jésus. This woman has, is becoming a nuisance. Cette femme devient une nuisance. Send her away. Chasse-la. She's disturbing our peace. Elle dérange notre paix. 
her away. Dérange la chaque. That was not all. C'était pas tout. Jesus said to her. Jésus lui a dit. What you are asking me to do? Ce que tu me demandes de faire. Is meant only for the children. C'est seulement pour les enfants. It's not meant for the dogs. C'est pas pour les chiens. That was an insult. C'était une insulte. As, long, as far as that woman was concerned. Il concernait cette femme. To call somebody a dog. Appeler quelqu'un un chien. I know some of, sometimes we feel like that. Parfois on se sent comme ça. We pray, nothing is happening. On prie rien ne se produit. It's as God is not ma- is unmindful of us. C'est comme si Dieu s'en fout de nous. We do everything but God is not listening. On fait tout mais Dieu n'écoute pas. But we learn a lesson from this woman. On a pris une leçon de cette femme. And that is the lesson of persistence. C'est la leçon de la persévérance. Persistence. La persévérance. Jesus did not listen to her. Jésus l'a pas écouté. That didn't drive her away. She kept she kept disturbing the Lord. Elle a continué à déranger. The, the disciples tried to discourage her. Les disciples essayaient de la décourager. She refused to be discouraged. Elle a refusé d'être découragée. Tell you there are times you pray. Il y a des moments où tu pries. And people will be discouraging you. Les gens te découragent. You don't they go to you have been going to you you been praying what have you got from it? The people Quand will discourage you. Les gens vont te décourager. Even some, sometimes men of God may even discourage you. Même les hommes de Dieu vont te décourager. Men of God in quotes. Les hommes de Dieu entre guillemets. People are supposed to bless you in prayer. Ceux qui doivent te bénir dans la prière. They discourage you. Ils te découragent. But this woman persisted. Cette femme a persévéré. Even when she felt insulted. Même quand elle s'est sentie insultée. She said, I don't mind if you call me a dog. Oh, tu m'appelles tu as long as I get what I want. Aussi longtemps que je veux. I won't leave you until I get what I want. Je te laisserai pas parce que j'ai ce que je veux. And glory be to God. Et gloire à Dieu. In verse 28. Au verset 28. We see that she got her result. On voit qu'elle a eu son résultat. Jesus said to her finally. Jésus lui a dit finalement. Let it be to you. Qu'il te soit fait. As your desire. Selon que tu désires. Let it be to you. Qu'il te soit fait. As your desire. Selon ton désir. So she got a result. Elle a eu un résultat. For her persistence in prayer. Pour sa persévérance dans la prière. Her daughter became healed. Sa fille a été guérie. One of the things we are going to do today. Une des choses qu'on va faire aujourd'hui. Now in our Bible passage, James chapter 5. Dans Jacques 5. The Bible says we should pray for one another. Nous devons prier les uns pour les autres. One of the things we are going to do today. Une des qu'on va faire aujourd'hui. Is that you are going to pray for somebody. Tu vas prier pour quelqu'un. Begin to think about somebody that needs your prayer. Alors here. commence à quel- penser à quelqu'un qui your father, could be your mother somewhere. Ton père, ta mère, could be your brother, could be anybody. N'importe qui. That person is in trouble somewhere. Cette personne a des problèmes. That person, you know, needs help somewhere. Cette personne a besoin d'aide. You are going to pray for the person. Tu vas prier pour la This personne. This woman prayed. She interceded. Cette femme a prié, elle a intercédé. For her daughter, pour sa fille, who was sick, qui était malade. And she got a result. Elle a eu un résultat. As you stand in the gap, comme tu tiens la brèche, as you intercede, comme tu intercèdes, as you pray for somebody in this place today, comme tu pries pour quelqu'un dans ce lieu aujourd'hui, God will answer your prayer. Dieu va exaucer ta prière. According to your desire, selon ton désir, it shall be granted unto you. Tu seras accordé. In the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. And listen, when you pray for others. Your own prayers get answered also. Remember, I told you some time ago. The Bible says that when Job prayed for his friends, God answered his own prayer. He prayed for his friends. And God remembered him. As you pray for somebody today, as you stand in the gap and intercede for somebody today, the Lord will remember you. In the name of Jesus. The other woman is found in Luke. Et dans Luc, chapter 2. Luc 2. I always love to refer to this woman. J'aime me référer à cette femme. Because there are one or two things that we can also learn from her. On peut apprendre une ou deux choses de cette femme. Luke chapter 2. Luc 2. From verse 36 to 37. I'll read very quickly. Luke chapter 2. Luc 2. 36 to 37. Now there was one, Anna, a prophetess, the daughter of Phanuel, of the tribe of Asher. She was of a great age. And had lived with a husband seven years from her virginity. And this woman was a widow of about 84 years, who did not depart from the temple, but served God with fastings and prayers night and day. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> the first, what is the big lesson from this woman? Quelle est la leçon de cette femme? The first lesson, beloved. La première leçon bien aimée. Is that you and I, we have no excuse not to pray. C'est que vous et moi n'avons pas de raison, n'avons pas d'excuse de ne pas prier. You have no excuse not to pray. On n'a pas d'excuse de ne pas prier. I have no excuse not to pray. On n'a pas d'excuse de ne pas prier. This was a woman of 84 years. Voici une femme de 84 ans. 84 years. 84 ans. A widow. Une veuve. 84 years. 84 ans. But the Bible says she did not depart from the temple. Elle n'a pas, elle n'a pas quitté le temple. She was regular in church. Elle était régulière à l'église. For some of us. Vous êtes entre nous. I perceive that some of us have registered in our home. Alors certains ont des, des, des calendrier chez eux. First Sunday I was in church. Premier dimanche j'étais à l'église. I can skip second and third. Je peux ne pas venir premier et deuxième. Maybe the last Sunday I will go to church again. Le troisième j'irai à l'église. Oh, the last Sunday is power service. Oh, le dernier service That's de when I'm anointing the flow. C'est là où il y a l'onction. First Sunday. Premier dimanche. It's Thanksgiving. C'est l'action de grâce. There's so much joy. Il y a beaucoup de joie. So some people target those two Sundays. Certains ont bien ces deux jours. This was the Bible says she did it the 84 year old woman. Une femme de 84 ans. Regular in church. Elle était régulière How à l'église. How regular 
Where are you to the house of God? Alors, quelle est votre régularité dans la maison David de Dieu? Said, David a dit, I was glad. J'étais when, content. When they said, let us go into the house of God. On m'a dit, allons dans la maison de when Dieu. When it's time to go to church, are you happy? Est-ce que tu es content quand c'est l'heure d'aller à l'église? Or, or is it a burden when ou, you are coming to church? Ou c'est un fardeau quand tu viens à l'église? Eighty-four year old woman. Une femme de quatre ans. She was regular in church. Elle était régulière à l'église. Look at her. The Bible says she was fasting and praying. La Bible dit qu'elle jeûnait et priait. Eighty-four year old woman. Une femme de quatre ans. She was still fasting. Elle jeûnait. She was still fasting. Elle jeûnait. When was the last time you fasted? Quelle est la dernière fois où tu as Jeûner. See fasting and praying. Le jeûne et la prière. At the age of 84. À l'âge de 84. See another ans. thing there. Une autre chose. The Bible says she was fasting and praying night and day. Elle jeûnait et priait nuit et jour. Well, that, that, that takes us to what we said earlier. Ça nous amène à ce qu'on a dit plus tôt. When was the last, last time you had a vigil on your own? Quelle est la dernière fois où tu as une veillée pour toi-même? 84 year old woman. Une femme de 84 ans. She was still ans. fasting. Elle jeûnait. She was still she praying she was still regular in church and l'église. she was still doing night vigil et elle faisait la nuit de 84 prière 84 year old 84 ans some of us you sleep from 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 10 pm to 10 am c'est un homme de 22 heures à 10 heures 12 heures, 12 heures. some people they, they won't even even if mosquito is biting them <laughs> is the is the mosquito that we died <laughs> oh my god <laughs> hallelujah amen and you know we are talking about a woman here. On parle d'une femme ici. Honestly, I like to pray for all the women here. Je voudrais prier pour toutes les in femmes. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Au nom Christ, puissant de Jésus. Every woman in this house. Toute femme dans ce lieu. Receive the fire of prayer. Recevoir reçoit le feu de la prière. Receive the fire of prayer. Reçoit le feu de la prière. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You know women are very important. Les femmes sont importantes. Very very important. Très important. When women pray, men in fact, I have discovered that in most families, in, mo- in most homes, j'ai découvert que dans plusieurs maisons, the women have taken over the role of the men. Les femmes ont pris le rôle des hommes. The men that are supposed to be to be the pastor in the house. Les hommes qui doivent être les pasteurs dans la maison. They're supposed to be working the family to pray. Ils doivent réveiller la famille pour prier. They don't have time to pray. Ils n'ont pas le temps pour prier. It is the women that are doing everything. C'est les femmes qui font tout. If you are a man here and you are, your wife is still the, pa- you know, she has, has taken over your role in the house. That will, it will be reversed in Jesus name. Si, si, si tu es un homme et la femme a pris you place, are the man you are, Sorry my, my dear sister. You are the man you are supposed to be leading the prayer in the house. Tu es l'homme tu dois tu as dirigé la prière dans ta maison. But maison. your wife is leading the prayer. Mais ta femme dirige you la prière. You better wake up. You better wake up. Réveille-toi, réveille-toi. Because before you become a woman. Avant que tu deviennes une femme. You won't become a woman in Jesus. Tu ne deviens pas Jesus une femme name. au nom de Jésus. Hallelujah. Amen. But honestly, this woman teaches us a lot of I'm challenged. And that's why I love to use her example all the time. J'aime utiliser son exemple parce que je suis défié. By this woman. Je suis défié par How old femme. am I? Alors quel âge est-ce que j'ai? I will not be able to pray in the night. Que je peux pas prier la nuit. How old am I? Quel âge est-ce que j'ai? It's a four-year-old woman. Une femme de 84 ans. She was praying and fasting. Elle priait et jeûnait. Tell some people to fast. They, they, in fact, the day you announce fast, that's the day they remember that they have ulcer. God will deliver such people in Jesus' name. Amen. Let's go on. Continuons. Our text talks about a particular man. Notre texte parle d'un homme. A man of prayer. Un homme de prière. Elijah. Eli. And I like us to learn some things from Elijah Apprenons also. Apprenons quelque chose de la vie d'Eli. Elijah was a man of prayer. Eli était un homme de prière. Please turn your Bible to 1 Kings chapter 18. Allons dans 1 roi 18. 1 Kings chapter 18. 1 roi 18. I'm going to read verse 41 and 42. Je vais lire le verset 41 and et 42. And then we'll take the other verses later. Et on lira les autres 1 après. 1 Kings chapter 18. 1 roi 18. From verse 41. Verset 41. Let's go. Then Elijah said to Ahab, Go up. Eat and drink, for there is the sound of abundance of rain. So Ahab went up to eat and drink, and Elijah went up to the top of Camel. Then he bowed down on the ground and put his face between his knees. Hallelujah. Now, the first thing you observe from the, in, in, this, in, the, in those two verses La première chose qu'on observe dans ces deux versets is the difference between two people. La différence entre deux personnes. Two names were mentioned there. Deux noms étaient mentionnés. One is Elijah. Un est Eli. One is Ahab. L'autre est Ahab. One was a man of eating and drinking. Un était un homme de manger et boire. The other one was a man of fasting and praying. L'autre était un homme de jeûne et de prière. Elijah said to Ahab. Eli a dit à Ahab. You go eat and drink. Toi va manger. That is what we know you for. C'est ce qu'on te connaît. That is what you have come to this world to do. C'est ce que tu veux dans ce monde. And drink. Va va manger et boire. And the Bible says the man went and started eating and drinking. Et l'homme est parti, il a commencé à manger et boire. Eating and drinking. Manger et boire. Meanwhile, the Pendant Bible says temps, Elijah went on top of the mountain. Ça veut dire que Élie est allé sur le sommet de la montagne. To pray. Pour prier. You go and eat and drink. Tu vas manger et boire. And the man went and he started eating and drinking. Et il est parti manger et boire. Whereas Elijah went to the mountain. Élie est allé sur la montagne. To pray. 
Il allait prier. I ask you once again, brothers and sisters, when was the last time you fasted? Quelle la dernière fois vous avez jeûné? When others are fasting, lorsque les autres jeûnent, you are eating and you are drinking. Tu manges et tu bois. I pray for you. Je prie pour May vous. May you not eat your future and your destiny away in ne Jesus' name. Ne mange pas votre futur, votre destiny au nom de Jésus. Elijah went to the top of the mountain to pray. Elie allait sur le sommet de la montagne à prier. And you know when you read that thing, you see you see the kind of prayer that Elijah prayed. Alors on voit le genre de prière qu'Élie a prié. The Bible says he went there and he bowed on the ground. La Bible dit qu'il est allé et il s'est prosterné. Listen to me. If your if your if your bed is too comfortable for si you to pray. Si ton lit est confortable pour prier. Sometimes lie on the floor. Parfois couche-toi au I sol. I am telling you from experience. Je vous dis par expérience. There are times you want to pray and you are lying on your bed. Il y a des moments où tu veux prier tu te couches sur le lit. And I know some of you your bed is water bed. Certains ont un lit Very bientôt. succulent bed. C'est un bien très bon lit. Mattress is succulent. Le matelas est the bien. pillow is succulent. Le, le, le so est bon. the moment you land like this, Alors, quand tu te couches, you are already off. Tu es déjà Even before you hit the bed, you are already snoring. Avant que te coucher, tu, tu Sometimes déjà. when I want to pray, I lie flat on the when the hard ground. Parfois quand je vais prier, je me couche hard ground. au sol. I told you of some of our one, one of our fathers in the Lord, one of our pastors. Old Alors, pa- is an old man now. Alors un de nos pasteurs c'est un vieil homme maintenant. He said in those days when he wanted to pray, Et avant quand il voulait prier, he would look for pebbles, stones, and put them on the ground. Il cherchait les pierres, il les and kneel on the stone et il se mettait à genoux so sur les pierres pour qu'il ne tombe pour qu'il ne tombe pas but i know pas. even if some people kneel on stone they will still sleep mais il y a des gens même s'ils sont sur les pierres ils vont dormir if you kneel on stone and you are still sleeping si tu te mets à genoux sur les pierres ah, tu dors it's only god that can deliver that person no il y a deliverance il faut que tu délivres cette personne so this man alors cet homme elijah Eli. He went and lied on the ground. Il est allé se coucher au sol. And the Bible says he put his face between his knees. La Bible dit qu'il a mis ses pieds. That's a very uncomfortable position to pray. Il a mis sa face sur ses genoux. Because he wanted, you know. So if you want to pray, alors si tu veux prier, you need to get up from your bed. Alors quitte ton lit. You know, just walk around the home. Alors marche dans la maison. Get yourself into an uncomfortable. Make make yourself uncomfortable so that you will not be able to sleep. Rends-toi inconfortable pour que tu ne dormes pas. Me, while somebody was somebody was eating and drinking. Pendant que quelqu'un d'autre mangeait et buvait. How many people? How many people know here that we 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 are supposed to fast at least once in a week? How many people Alors, here know? Alors, combien de personnes savent ici qu'on doit jeûner au moins une fois par semaine? If you know, raise your hand. Si tu sais, lève la main. At least we are supposed to fast one day in On a week. On doit jeûner une fois par semaine. And what day is that day? Et quel est ce jour? Friday. Vendredi. Friday. Vendredi. Once a week. Une fois par semaine. Ca- the last the, the, the last fasting we had, the last general fasting we had. Alors le dernier jeûne général qu'on a eu. After that fasting, I know some people are here who have not fasted since then. Et il y a des gens qui n'ont pas jeûné depuis ce I'm jour-là. I'm telling you the truth, brethren. Je vous dis d'ailleurs, bien-aimés. The Bible says there are some things that will not happen except with fasting and praying. Il y a des choses qui n'arriveront pas moins qu'on jeûne et on prie. You are faced with difficult situations. Tu fais face aux situations difficiles. You need to take difficult decisions. Tu dois prendre des décisions difficiles. You need to take it seriously. Tu dois prendre cela au sérieux. I'm serious about what I'm teaching you today. Je we need sérieux. to be people of fasting and praying. Nous devons être des gens de jeûne et de prière. And results will come. Et les résultats viendront. Let's leave that one. Let's go to verse 43. Allons au verset 43. Verse 43. Verset 43. And he said to his servant, Go up now. Look toward the sea. So he went and looked up and said, There is nothing. And seven times he said, Go again. Amen. 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 What is the lesson here? Quelle est la leçon ici? Number one lesson here. La première leçon. Is what I said earlier. Learn to be persistent in the place of prayer. Apprenez à être persévérant dans la prière. Don't give up easily. N'abandonnez pas rapidement. Don't give up. N'abandonnez Elijah pas. Elijah said to his servants. Elie a dit à son serviteur. Go and check whether there is a result to the prayer that I prayed. Va vérifier s'il y a un résultat à la prière que j'ai prié. The man went. L'homme est allé. And came back. Et il est revenu. And said nothing. Et il a dit rien. I can't see anything. Je ne vois rien. And so sometimes you pray. Alors parfois on prie. And you see nothing. Et on ne voit rien. It's as if nothing is happening. C'est comme si rien ne se passe. Elijah said to the man. Il a dit alors. Go seven times. Va cette fois. So the man went seven times. L'homme est parti sept fois. So sometimes you need to pray and pray and Parfois pray again. Prier, over a particular prier, matter. Prier encore sur un sujet. Before you begin to see the result. Avant de commencer à voir un résultat. Have you been praying concerning a matter and it looks as if nothing is happening? Est-ce que tu pries sur un sujet et c'est comme si rien n'arrive? Keep hammering on that thing. Continue à cogner. Nothing may seem to be happening in the physical. Alors rien ne semble arriver dans le physique. But I tell you something is happening in the spiritual. Mais dans le spirituel quelque chose se produit. When that man went and he didn't see anything. Quand l'homme est allé il n'a rien vu. He didn't mean that not something was not happening. C'est pas comme si rien n'arrivait. Something was happening but he didn't see it yet. Quelque chose se produisait mais il n'a pas encore vu. I'm trying to give you an example using this particular wall. Je vais utiliser un exemple en utilisant ce mur. You want to bring down a wall. Tu veux faire tomber un mur. And you look for a hammer, a sledgehammer. Tu cherches un marteau. And you hit this wall. Et tu cognes ce mur. When you hit it the first Quand tu la première the fois, wall is standing like uh, like the devil. Le mur est là comme le I, won't, I won't break. 
You hit it the first time. You hit it the second time. With sledgehammer. That wall is still standing. To you, there's nothing happening. But I tell you, that wall knows that something is happening. That wall is getting weaker and weaker. There is one particular blow you will give to that wall. And then you will see a crack. And then you give another blow. And that wall comes down. That is the way prayer is. You keep hitting that thing with prayer. You hit it and hit it. It's as something is happening. Something is happening inside. And very soon, you will see a crack in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus. Verse 44. Then it came to pass the seventh time that he said, There is a cloud. The guy came back and said, Ah, this time I see a cloud as small as a man's hand rising out of the sea. So he said, Elijah said to him, Go up, say to Ahab, prepare your chariot and go down before the rain stops you. Suddenly something started to change. Alors, soudainement, quelque chose a commencé à changer. It was as if nothing was happening, but suddenly, Mais soudainement, things started to change. Les choses ont commencé à it changer. It began with a small cloud. Ça a commencé avec un petit You will nuage. begin to see changes in your situation. Il y aura des changements dans ta situation. No matter how little it is, in the name of Quelle Jesus. Quelle que soit la petitesse au nom de Jésus. Verse 45. Le verset 45. Now it happened in the meantime that the sky became black with clouds and wind, and there was a heavy rain. So Ahab rode away and went to Jezreel. So that small cloud. Alors ce petit nuage now became a big cloud. Est devenu un grand nuage. And there was a heavy rain. Et il y a une pluie battante. As you persist in the place of prayer. Comme tu persévères dans la prière. What that means is that you know your life will keep getting better. Ta vie va continuer à s'améliorer. It started with a small cloud. Ça a commencé avec un petit nuage. And then it became a big cloud. C'est devenu un grand nuage. And then it became rain. Et c'est devenu la pluie. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. Je prie pour vous au nom de Jésus. As you persist in the place of prayer. Comme tu persévères dans la prière. Your life will keep getting better and better. Ta vie deviendra meilleure et meilleure. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Au nom puissant de Jésus. Look at verse 46. Regardez au verset 46. Then the hand of the Lord came upon Elijah and he gathered up his loins and ran ahead of Ahab to the entrance of Jezreel. Hallelujah. Amen. Now in verse 44, verse 44, verse 44, we see Ahab who had been eating and drinking. On voit Ahab qui mangeait et qui buvait. He mounted a horse il est monté sur and un, he started the journey il a commencé le voyage to Jezreel. But in verse 46, no, verse 46 we see Elijah, Elise, the man of prayer. De prière, he started running il a à and he overtook et Ahab. Il a dépassé Ahab. And he got to Jezreel, il est à Jezreel before Ahab. Avant Ahab. The man that was eating and drinking, qui et buvait, he was riding a horse. Il cou, il était sur, il était the sur man that was praying, un cheval, qui he priait, was running il courait, and he got there et il est before the one who was fasting, I mean who was eating and drinking. Avant celui qui et buvait, in the name of Jesus Christ, au nom de Jésus Christ those who have gone ahead Ahead of you. Ceux qui sont allés au devant de vous. Because you are a man of prayer. Parce que tu es un homme de prière. A man of fasting. Un homme de jeûne. You will overtake them. Tu vas les dépasser. You will get to destination before them. Tu vas arriver avant eux. In the mighty name of Jesus. Au nom puissant de Jésus. People of prayer. Les gens de prière. They are overtakers. Ils sont des dépasseurs. I pray in the name of Jesus. Je prie au nom de Jésus. You will be an overtaker. Tu seras un dépasseur. In the name of Jesus Christ. Au nom de Jésus Christ. Hallelujah. Amen. Let them be eating and drinking. Qui mangent et qui boivent. But God will give you promotion, faster promotion than them. Je te donnerai une promotion plus grande que eux. We are fasting and praying. Alors quand je n'ai and people are laughing at us. Et les gens se moquent When de our nous. blessing comes, quand la bénédiction arrive, those who raise their, their head and raise their mouth, alors ceux qui ont ouvert leur bouche, God will slap them in the name of Jesus. Dieu va les gifler au nom de Jésus. Hallelujah. Amen. There are some people who are not ready to pray. Il y a des gens qui ne sont pas prêts à prier. Some who are looking for prayer contractors. Ceux qui, ceux qui cherchent des, des contracteurs you know, de prière. You know, there are people who are still looking for people who will, who will pray for them. Il y a des gens qui cherchent ceux qui vont prier pour some eux. Some people send money to some people and say, pray for me. Il y a des gens qui envoient l'argent et disent, prie pour moi. They will use your money to eat pepper soup and pounded diam. Ils vont utiliser ton argent pour, pour manger le, 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 le pounded diam. You can't pray for yourself. You send money to somebody. Ah, what? You, in fact, you are bribing the person now. En fait, tu, tu corromps la personne. Fast for me. The man will use your money to enjoy himself. Alors la personne va utiliser ton argent pour I've told you the story before, and it's true. Je vous ai raconté l'histoire, c'est vrai. This man had a problem. Cet homme avait un problème. And he went to a prophet. Il allait chez un prophète. And prophet saw vision for him. Et le prophète avait une vision. I said, man, what we are going to do? Il a dit ce qu'on va faire. We are going to do seven days fasting and prayer. On va faire sept jours de jeûne et de prière. And the man said, uh, you know, now, I mean, a sophisticated guy like me, I, I, don't, I, I, don't, I ain't got time for fasting. Et l'homme lui a dit, non, je n'ai pas le temps de prier. And the man said, well, if you can't fast, I will fast for you. L'homme a dit, si tu peux pas jeûner, je vais jeûner pour toi. But give me so so amount of money. Mais donne-moi ce montant d'argent. So that because there are some things. 
we need to do. Passer des choses qu'on doit faire. Give me money. I'll, 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 is it knowledge? I've done 41 days for people. Give me some money. I'll, I'll Alors, fast donne-moi l'argent, je vais jeûner pour toi. So he gave the man money. Il donnait à l'homme l'argent. Two days to the fasting. Deux jours après le jeûne. He suddenly remembered. Il s'est souvenu. There is another problem I didn't tell this man. Il y a un autre problème que je n'ai pas dit à cet homme. I need to go and meet him so that I can add it to the prayer list. Alors, je dois le, je dois aller le voir pour qu'il ajoute cela à la prière. So he went to the man's house. Il est dans la maison de l'homme. And because he was so familiar with the man. Parce qu'il était familier à l'homme. He didn't even bother to knock. Il n'a même pas cogné. He just opened the door. Il a ouvert la porte. And he saw prophet. Il a vu le prophète. Prophet was sitting down. Il était assis. He didn't have shirt. No, no shirt. No nothing. Il n'avait pas de. de and he was sweating. Et il transpirait. A big bowl of pandadiam in front of him. Un grand plat de pandadiam. Fresh fish in one plate. Alors le, le poisson. Chicken on another plate. La, la Goat meat in another plate. La chèvre. And the man was sweating. Et l'homme transpirait. The man looked at him. Ah! He was so angry. He used his leg to kick the table and overturn the whole food. Alors il a, il était, il était fâché. Il a cogné la table. That is what they do with your money. Ce qu'ils font avec votre argent. You can't pray and fast for yourself. You are looking for prayer contractor. Pourquoi tu cherches les contracteurs pour prier pour toi? You are deceiving yourself. Tu te trompes toi. You know what the Bible says concerning Elijah? C'est ce que la Bible dit concernant Elie. The Bible says Elijah was a man of like nature, like you and I. La Bible dit que Elie est un homme avec la même nature que moi. He had flesh and blood. Il avait la chair et le sang. He had his own problems. Il avait ses problèmes. He was a man that was eating rice and 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 burger like you. Il mangeait le riz comme vous et moi. Elijah was not an angel. Et il n'était pas un ange. But he prayed. Mais il a prié. And there was results. Et il y a eu un résultat. If Elijah a man can pray and get results. Alors si Elie un homme peut prier, il a des résultats. You can also pray and get results. Vous aussi pouvez prier et avoir des résultats. Be a man of prayer. Be a woman of prayer. Une femme de prière. That is the challenge for you and I today. Ça c'est le défi pour vous et moi aujourd'hui. Elijah was a man like like passion. Elie était un homme comme vous et moi. He prayed, he commanded the heavens. Il a prié, il a commandé le ciel. No rain will fall. Aucune pluie ne tombera. Until I say so. Quand ce que je dis cela. And it was so. Et c'était comme ça. You can command the environment. Tu peux commander l'environnement. The Bible says. La Bible dit. Command the day. Commande le jour. Command the day. Commande le jour. Let me teach you another form of prayer that you can pray every day. Je vous dis une forme de prière que vous pouvez faire tous les jours. In our home, every day we pray it. Dans notre maison tous les jours nous prions. The Bible says you command the day. Tu commandes le jour. You speak to every day. Tu parles à chaque jour. It will be a day of joy for me and my family. This day will be a day of good news. A day of favor. A day of open doors. You speak to the day. Every blessing. The Bible says God loads us with benefits every day. Every blessing and benefit that God has loaded for today. My own will not elude me. You will command the day. Even God gave us. He gave us the permission to command Him. Dieu a demandé, Dieu donne la permission de le commander. He says concerning the works of my hands. Il a dit concernant l'œuvre de ma main. Command me. Commandez-moi. So you can command God. On peut commander Dieu. There's a level you get to as a man of as a prayer warrior. Il y a un niveau où tu arrives à prier. You begin to command God. God is the one that said it. Dieu est celui qui l'a dit. Command me concerning the works of my hands. Commande-moi concernant l'œuvre de mes mains. God will respond. Et Dieu va répondre. So we need to be men and women of prayer. On doit être des hommes et des femmes de prière. For us to get beautiful results. Pour que nous ayons des bons résultats. Hallelujah. Amen. As we begin to round up, I have to mention something that the Holy Spirit laid in my heart, and that is the place of parents la place des parents praying for their children prier pour leurs enfants parents praying for their children les parents qui prient pour leurs enfants and I'm so happy that you know the the annual convention that we went for alors la convention annuelle dans laquelle nous sommes allés the the guest minister Le, le ministre hôte. He says something about what I'm about to say. Il a dit quelque chose sur ce que je vais Just dire. Just confirm to, all, to, to me that this is what God wants me to say to you. Alors me. ça confirme ce que Dieu veut que je Particular vous dise. Particularly those of us who are parents. Pour ceux qui sont parents. The place of pray, parents in praying for their children. La place du parent dans la prière pour leurs enfants. It's very very important. C'est très important. It's very important. C'est très important. Now this important. man said. Cet homme a dit. He's a white guy. C'est un homme blanc, c'est un blanc. And he said each time his children are, are you know are going to school. Il dit chaque fois que ses enfants vont à l'école. Before they leave. Avant de partir. Because we are living in different worlds. Parce qu'on vit dans plus de différents mondes. As children of God, we are living in a different world. En tant qu'enfants de Dieu, nous vivons dans un monde différent. But the différent. systems of the world, they are Mais different. Mais le système du monde est différent. So when his children are in the home, alors quand les enfants sont à la maison, they are under a particular kind of cover. Ils sont dans une dans une couverture spiritual cover. Ils sont sous une couverture. But when they are in school, mais quand ils sont à l'école, this world is being run by by wickedness. Alors ce monde est dirigé par la méchanceté. So when they are in school, they are in a, under a different environment whatsoever. Quand ils sont à l'école, ils sont dans un environnement so before they leave home, he made sure that he, 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 he prays for them. He prays for them. He lays hands on them. 
les pose so that when they get into school, quand ils arrivent à l'école, whatever is happening in their environment, tout ce qui arrive dans leur environnement, will not will not affect them. Va pas les affecter. And I've told you several times. Je vous ai dit plusieurs fois. In my family, in our prayer altar, every morning. Dans ma famille, dans notre I prière, I pray for my children. Je prie pour mes enfants. I bless my children. Je bénis mes enfants. I pronounce blessings upon them. Je prononce bénédiction sur eux. Whatever I want for them, I pronounce it for them before tout they go to school. Tout ce que je veux pour eux, je prononce. Parents. Parents, you have a duty. Vous avez un devoir. To cover your children. De couvrir vos to enfants. To be a cover for your children. D'être une couverture pour vos enfants. Particularly the young ones. Pour les plus petits. Those ones who are in this, particularly in that class. Dans cette classe, t'as pas They are going to crèche. Ils vont à la crèche. They are going to nursery school. Ils vont à la maternelle. All manners of things are happening in that place. Tout genre de choses se produisent là-bas. You have a responsibility as a parent. Vous avez la responsabilité en tant que parent. To pray for your children. De prier pour vos Even enfants. Even the ones that are a bit older. Même ceux qui sont plus vieux. They are still in university. Ils sont à l'université. But they are still under your roof. Mais ils sont sous votre toit. As a parent. En tant que parent, you have a responsibility you have a to pray for them because eux. they go into so many things that they are not even aware of. And I'll show you an example. Je vais vous un exemple. The example of Job. Alors, de Job. Let's see how Job did it. Voyons comment Job In Job fait. chapter 1. Dans Job, 1. Job chapter 1. Job, chapitre 1. Job is just before Psalms. Job, Job chapter 1. I'll Job read from verse 4 1. to verse 5. Job chapter 1. Job 1. From verse 1 to verse 5. Verse 4 and his sons will go and feast in their houses. They will have party. Each on his appointed day. And will send and invite their three sisters to eat and drink with them. So it was. When the days of feasting had run their course. After the feasting and everything. Then Job will send and sanctify them. And he will rise early in the morning. And offer burnt, burnt offerings according to the number of them all. On each, every, on each of them, he will pray different prayers. For Job said, It may be that my sons have sinned and caused God in their hearts. Thus Job did regularly. So, he had sons and daughters. Il avait les fils et les filles. But he was not taking chances, chances with them. Mais il ne, il ne, il ne These pas boys, de you know boys now, they will gather together and organize party. Parfois, ils se mettaient ensemble, ils organisaient and la then fête. they will call their sisters to come and join them. Et ils appelaient leurs soeurs de venir les joindre. And of course, those ones too, they will go. Et elles, elles allaient aussi. They will enjoy themselves. Et ils se réjouissaient. They will celebrate. Célébrer. But after they are finished, Mais après est fini, Job will call them. Job les appelait. And then he will sanctify them. Et il les sanctifiait. And pray for them. Et priait pour eux. Perhaps in their, in their moment of enjoyment, you know, there's no, there's no problem with organizing parties. So. Remember that Job was a, was a righteous man. Job était un homme juste. He was a good man. Il était un bon homme. Just like you and I. I mean, our children organize parties, don't they? Nos enfants organisent des fêtes. So there's nothing wrong with organizing parties. Il n'y a rien à organiser une fête. But in those parties, Mais dans ces fêtes, it's possible that some things might have been done that is wrong. C'est possible que quelque chose soit passé qui ne soit pas bien. So after they have finished those parties, Donc après qu'ils aient fini leur fête, Job will call them. Job les appelait. And sanctify them. Et les sanctifier. Whatever they did that was wrong. Tout ce qu'ils avaient fait qui n'était pas bien. While they were enjoying themselves. Quand ils se réjouissaient. Lord, have mercy on them. Seigneur, aie pitié These de eux. These are my children. Sois mes enfants. He will pray for them. Il priait pour and eux. And the Bible says every morning. Il fait tous les matins. Upon every one of them, sur chacun d'eux, he will pray upon every one of them. Il priait sur chacun d'eux. And he did this regularly. Et il a fait régulièrement. Parents, parents, I beg you in the name of Jesus Christ, be a cover for your children. Soit une couverture pour tes enfants. They may still be very small. Peut être très petits. Or they may be older. Ou ils peuvent être vieux. But as long as they are still under your roof, mais aussi longtemps qu'ils sont dans ta maison, you have a responsibility for them. Une responsabilité pour eux. To pray for them. De prier pour eux. This is the message that God is sending to parents. C'est le message que Dieu envoie aux parents. Be a praying father. Sois un papa qui prie. And be a praying mother. Et sois une maman qui prie. And God will help you in Jesus' name. Et Dieu au nom de Jésus. As we said earlier, comme on a dit plus tôt, any Christian, tout chrétien, who refuses to pray, qui refuse de prier, or take prayer, he takes prayer lightly, ou prend la prière à la légère, he will pay for it. Il va payer pour cela. You know, I learned something from my pastor a long time ago. Alors j'ai appris une chose de mon pasteur il y a longtemps. He said, you need to pray today. Tu dois prier aujourd'hui so that you can play tomorrow. Pour que tu puisses jouer demain. But if you play today, Mais si tu joues aujourd'hui, I'm telling you you will pray tomorrow. Demain tu vas prier. So pray today. Prie aujourd'hui. So that you can play tomorrow. Pour que tu puisses jouer demain. So those of us who have not been praying. Pour ceux qui ne prient pas. Any, any Christian who takes prayer, who, who takes prayer lightly and is not praying. Tout chrétien qui prend la prière à la légère et ne prie pas. He will pray for he will pray for it. Un jour il va payer pour In cela. In Acts chapter 12. Dans Acte 12. Acts chapter 12. Acte 12. C'est un very good example there. C'est un bon exemple. Acts chapter 12. Acte from verse 1 to 12 from verse 1 to 4 12 1 to 4 there was a king called Herod he began by the bible says he started by harassing the church 
Il a commencé à harasser l'église. Il a envoyé la police à l'église. Pour aller les déranger. Il les harassait. Quand ils sont supposés de faire service à 9, ils vont organiser les places. Ils dérangeaient le lieu. Donc il a commencé à harasser l'église. 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 Il a commencé à When he saw that that one nothing happened, he the Bible arrivé, says he proceeded again. He caught Peter. He attacked Peter. And he was going to kill Peter. He was going to kill Peter. So you can see the sequence. You can see the sequence. He started by harassing. He started by harassing. He started by harassing. When he saw that nothing was happening, he caught James. He attacked James. He killed James. He attacked James. He killed 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 James. He Nous tuons tous. So in verse five, alors verset cinq, they began to pray. Ils ont commencé à prier. They began to pray. Ils ont commencé à prier. Perhaps if they had prayed when that man was harassing the church, peut-être qu'ils avaient prié lorsque l'homme harassait l'église. Perhaps they would have saved the life of James. Ils auraient sauvé la vie de Jacques. But the man was harassing the church. Mais l'homme harassait l'église. Everybody was sleeping. Tout le monde dormait. So he took James and killed James. Il a pris Jacques et l'a tué. And then when after killing James, he took Peter and they say, Ah, Peter is going. You know, after Peter, only God knows who is next. Alors quand il a attrapé Pierre, ils ont dit, Oh, mais après Pierre. So the church woke up in verse five. L'église s'est levée au verset cinq. And they began to pray. Ils ont commencé à prier. And deliverance came. Et la délivrance I est pray in the name of Jesus Je Christ. Au nom de Jésus. The fire of prayer le feu du is coming prière. upon you today. In the name of Jesus au nom Christ. De Jésus. Please stand to your feet. Men and women of prayer, stand to your feet. De, et femmes de prière, Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Please stand to your feet. We are about to pray. Pieds, on va prier. We will know now whether you are a man or a woman of prayer. On verra maintenant si vous êtes un homme ou une femme de prière. But before we begin to pray, avant de commencer à prier. Our text, James 5:16. Notre text, Jacques. It says the effectual fervent prayer of a righteous man. La prière fervente du juste. Of a righteous man. Du juste. Of a righteous man. Du juste. Avec ce much. A une grande efficacité. God does not hear sinners. Alors Dieu n'écoute pas les pécheurs. God hears righteous people. Dieu écoute les personnes. Who is a righteous man? Qui est un homme juste? A righteous man is a man that is born again. Un homme juste est celui qui est né de nouveau. Washed in the blood of Jesus. Lavé dans le sang de Jésus. Not necessarily a perfect man. Pas un homme parfait. Nobody is. Perfect, Personne n'est parfait. But you must be born again. Mais tu dois être né de nouveau. You must accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior. Accepter Jésus comme ton Seigneur et Sauveur. For your prayer to have effect. Pour que ta prière ait de l'effet. For your prayer to have effect. Pour que ta prière ait de l'effet. You must be a righteous man. Tu dois être un homme. Are you here and you are not born again? Est-ce que tu es ici tu n'es pas né de nouveau? No matter the amount of prayer you pray, God will not answer. Quelles sont les prières que tu vas prier, God does not hear sinners. Dieu n'écoute pas les pécheurs. But if any man is a is a righteous man, mais si un homme est un homme juste, Dieu est prêt à l'écouter. Tu es prêt à l'écouter. You are here, you are not born again. Jésus, tu n'es pas né de nouveau. Please surrender. Your life to Jesus. We are going to take some serious prayers now. On va faire des prières maintenant. And unless, un, unless you don't want your prayer to be answered, then. Et à moins que tu veux que ta prière soit exaucée. But you want your prayer to be answered today. Tu veux que ta prière soit exaucée. You must do the right thing. Tu dois faire la Give your life to Jesus. Donne ta vie à Jésus. Accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior. Accepte Jésus comme son Seigneur. Let Jesus come into your life. Que Jésus vienne dans ta vie. And take over the rulership of your life. Et bien diriger ta vie. And then you can pray. Et tu pourras prier. And you will receive answers. Et tu recevras. Anybody you want to give your life to Jesus. You are yet to be born again. You are not born again. You want to give your life to Jesus. Okay, Anybody in the house? Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. All right. We are going to pray now. On va prier maintenant. Brethren, the first prayer we are going to pray. La première prière qu'on va prier is that God will make us men and women of prayer. C'est que Dieu fasse de nous des femmes et des hommes de prière. We have seen the results. On a vu les résultats. We have seen how important it is for a man to pray. On a vu combien important est-ce pour un homme de prier. And for a woman to so your first prayer, prayer I like you to, 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 to say it loud and clear. Alors, dis-le à haute voix. Father, dis Père, make me a man of prayer. Fais de moi un homme de prière. Or make me a woman of prayer. Fais de moi une femme de prière. Revive my prayer life. Ravive ma vie de prière. Baptize me. Baptise-moi. With the fire of prayer. Avec le feu de la prière. In the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. You can see it on the screen so that you can pray very well. Sur le tableau Father, prier. make me a man of prayer. Père, fais de moi une femme de prière. Like Daniel. Comme Daniel. Like Nehemiah. Comme Nehemiah. Jesus was a man of prayer. Jésus était un homme de Lord, prière. Lord, make me a man of prayer. Mais on fait de moi une femme de prière. Revive my prayer life. Ravive ma vie de prière. Revive my prayer life. Ravive ma vie de prière. Baptize me with the fire of prayer. Baptise moi avec le feu de la prière. Let the fire of prayer come upon me. Et le feu de prière descend sur moi. I don't want to be a victim. Je veux pas être une victime. I don't want to be a victim of the devil. Je veux pas être une victime du diable. Make me a man of prayer. Fais de moi un homme de prière. Make me a man of prayer. Fais de moi un homme de prière. Make me a man of prayer. Fais de moi une femme de prière. Baptize me with the fire of prayer. 
In the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I don't want to be lazy in the place of prayer. Make me strong in the place of prayer. Make me a prayer man. A man of prayer. A man of prayer. A man of prayer. A man of prayer. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, my Father. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Want to take some serious prayers now? Prayer changes things, beloved. Prayer changes things. Nehemiah prayed. And things changed. Daniel prayed. Things changed. Elijah prayed. Paul prayed. Paul and Silas prayed. Jesus prayed. And things happened. As you pray these following prayers, things will happen in the name of Jesus. We see that some people conspired against Daniel. They set a trap for him. Anybody that prays is going into the den of lions. They set a trap for Daniel. But God didn't allow him to fall in. I'd like you to pray and say, Father, every trap Every trap that people have set for me, let them be caught in their own trap. In the name of Jesus Christ. Pray in the name of Jesus. Every trap that people have set for me, let them be caught in their own trap. In the name of Jesus Christ. People who have set a trap for you, people who have set a trap for me, they will be caught in their own trap. They will be caught in their own trap. They will be caught in their own trap. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father, we bless you. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Still praying along that line. Please repeat after me. I decree. Did you decree? Every conspiracy, Tout complot against me, contre moi, shall fail. Wherever people gather, wherever they gang up against me, scatter in the mighty name of Jesus. Pray, 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 pray in the name of Jesus. Every conspiracy against me, in your office, in your place of work, in your place of business, in your school, anywhere, even in your family, even in your family, every conspiracy against me, every conspiracy against me, they shall fail, they shall fail, they shall fail. They shall fail. Wherever people gang up against me, wherever they gang up, wherever they gang and they gather against me, I command them to scatter. Scatter in the name of Jesus. 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 Labo setere probosh kalima setere bosh. Regebo soto lichaba shataribo. Oleros. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. I told you earlier, you are going to intercede for somebody. Tu vas intercéder pour quelqu'un. You will choose the person you want to pray for. Alors choisis la personne que tu veux prier Could be your pour. father somewhere. Ça peut être ton père. Could be your mother. Ta mère. Could be your colleague. Ou ton collègue. Who is in trouble? Qui est dans les problèmes. You, the person needs help. La personne a besoin d'aide. The person is having a big problem. La personne a un problème. And you, 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 you are not happy with what is happening. Tu n'es pas content de ce qui arrive. I want you to, no, to, 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 to hold somebody, not, not hold anybody in the hand. I want you to just focus on somebody that you want to pray for and begin to pray for that person. 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 Just pick somebody and begin to pray for that person. Could be your father, could be your mother, could be your brother who is having some problem at home. Lord, please deal with that problem. Deal with that problem. Deal with that problem. Could be your colleague in the office who is having a big problem at home. Pray, pray, pray. That person may not even know that you are praying for him or for her. Be an intercessor. Be an intercessor. Be an intercessor. Pray for that person. As you pray for him or her, God will answer your own prayer. God will recognize you and answer your own prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, pray for your parents. Pray for your children. Your children that are far away somewhere. Please pray for them. Pray for them. That's your brother. That's your sister. Please remember him. Remember her. In the name of Jesus. Pray in the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Stand in the gap. Your husband, your wife. Your husband, your wife. Pray for him. Pray for her. Pray for him. Pray for her. In the name of Jesus. Pray, pray, pray. In the name of Jesus Christ. That person needs healing. Pray for healing. That person needs a job. Pray that God will give him a job. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, we give you praise. Thank you, Father. 
In Jesus' mighty name we are prayed. In Jesus' name we are prayed. Amen. We're going to take the last prayer. But before that prayer, we are going to sing a song on va une by Ron Kenoli. De Ron Kenoli. Ron Kenoli. Whose, whose report will you believe? Quel rapport we shall believe the report of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How many of us know this song? Hallelujah. We're going to show it on the, on the screen. Whose report will you believe by Ron Kenoli? Whose report will you believe? I shall believe the report of the Lord. Whose report will you believe? I shall believe the report of the Lord. Whose report will you believe? I shall believe the report of the Lord. Whose report will you believe? I shall believe the report of the Lord. His report says I am healed. His report says I am filled. His report says I am His report says victory. Whose report will you believe? I shall believe the report of the Lord. Whose report will you believe? I shall believe the report of the Lord. Whose report? Will you believe? I shall believe the report of the Lord. His report says I am healed. His report says I am free. His report says I am free. His report says victory. Hallelujah! Whose report will you believe? Will you believe the lie from the pit of hell? Will you believe the report of, of the devil? No. You believe the report of the Lord. Your last prayer is a, is a prophetic prayer. Say after me, in the name of Jesus, I reject and I cancel every evil report about my life. I believe the report of the Lord. I am healed. I am filled. I am free. I am rich. I am blessed. I am victorious. Go ahead and declare, declare, declare. I believe the report of the Lord. I believe the report of the Lord. I believe the report of the Lord. I am healed. I am filled with the Holy Ghost. I am filled with the Holy Spirit. I am free. I am free. I am free. I am victorious in the name of Jesus. I believe the report of the Lord. I believe the report of the Lord. I believe the report of the Lord. I am rich, I am blessed, I am victorious. It is well with me in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be the name of the Lord. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. The God of all flesh. Le Dieu de toute chair. The Alpha and the Omega. L'Alpha et l'Omega. We bless you and we give you praise. Nous te bénissons ton nom la louange. Thank you for your goodness. Merci pour ta bonté. Thank you for your faithfulness. Merci pour ta fidélité. The Bible says. La Bible dit. Luke 18, 1. Dans Luke 18 verset 1. Men ought always to pray. Les hommes doivent prier toujours. And not to faint. Et de ne pas tomber. I declare in the name of Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. You will not faint. Vous ne faillirez pas. You will not faint. Vous ne faillirez pas. You will not faint. Vous ne faillirez pas. The fire of prayer. La, le feu de la prière comes upon you in the name of Et Jesus. Au nom de Jésus. Everything that has been destroying your prayer life. Tout ce qui détruit votre vie de prière. That thing is destroyed today. Tout ce qui est détruit aujourd'hui. In the mighty name of Jesus. Au nom puissant de Jésus. Everything that has been making you to be lazy. Tout ce qui vous rendrait paresseux. In the place of prayer, Dans la prière, we disarm that thing today. On tout cela in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Christ. Jesus. receive the baptism of prayer. Le baptême de prière. Receive the grace to pray. Le la grâce receive de the grace to pray. Le la grâce receive de the power to pray. Le pouvoir de prier. Receive the spirit of prayer. 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 De prier. In the mighty name of Jesus.
mighty name of Jesus, Au nom de Jésus, as you persist in the place of prayer, comme vous la prière, your way will be open votre chemin sera in the mighty name of Jesus. Au nom de Everything Jésus, you have been trusting God for, tout ce que vous de Dieu, I beg you, don't be discouraged. Ne soyez pas Keep on trusting God. Continue à faire persist in the place of prayer. La don't believe the lie of the devil. Ne croyez pas don't du believe diable. the report of ne the doctor. Pas au du believe doctor. the report of Dr. Jesus. Au de Dr. You Jesus. are well in Jesus' vous name. Au nom de you Jésus. are healed in Jesus' vous name. Au nom de you Jésus. are filled with the Holy Ghost. You are filled with the Spirit of God. You are filled with the power of God. In the mighty name of Jesus. You are victorious in Jesus' name. You are a victor and not a victim. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we give you praise. Blessed be your name. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we are praying. Hallelujah. Offering time. Let us package, start packaging our offering to the glory of God. Far over to you. Hallelujah. Can we please be on our feet as we offer in our offering? Join me in praising God. I have seen His goodness. Join me in praising God. I have seen His goodness. Hallelujah. Join me in praising God. I have seen His goodness. Join me in praising God. In Jesus' name, in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Père Éternel, nous voulons te dire merci. Father, I want to say thank you. Merci une fois de plus pour l'opportunité d'être en ta présence ce matin. Thank you for the grace, the opportunity to be your presence. Père, accepte-nous et accepte nos prières. Father, please accept us and accept our offering. Une fois de plus, Père, nous te disons merci. Father, we say thank you. Parce que ce n'est pas ta volonté. Because it's because of your will. Que nous sommes réunis dans ce service ce matin. Nous te disons merci d'avance pour ta parole, for your word, pour ton enseignement, for your teaching, parce que tu, tu nous sommes persuadés, Père, because we know que nous sommes des hommes et des femmes de prière au nom because de Jésus. We are women and men of God. Parce que nous te l'avons demandé, Père éternel, because we have asked of you, Papa, rends cette prière pour Father, please make it possible. Tu dis dans le livre de Luc Father, you say in the book of Luke que rien n'était possible sans toi. C'est pour ça que mon Dieu et mon roi, That's why nous te demandons we are asking que toutes les impossibilités de notre vie that all the things that seem soient transformées in our en lives become possible. Par le pouvoir de la prière, Father, by prayer, par le pouvoir de ta parole By the power in your word. parce que dans ta parole Because in your word, il, y a la, il y a le pouvoir there is power. que ton nom soit sanctifié Let your word be sanctified. que ton nom soit glorifié Let your word name be glorified. nous avons mis une fois de plus au Seigneur une fois de plus Father, oh God, pour cette rentrée scolaire cette rentrée académique for this new academic year, parce que nos enfants because our children ont recommencé l'école et que tout se passe Très bien, au nom de Jésus. Father, we pray that all things nous te go confions, well. Seigneur, ce dernier ac académique scolaire Father, oh God, we entre tes mains. Confions nos enfants. Father, we commit our children. Confions également nos carrières parce que c'est la rentrée professionnelle. We also commit our careers into your hands. Entre tes mains, au oh Père. Into your hands. Et demandons que tu sois au contrôle. And we pray that you should be in control. Et que Papa, l'intelligence et la sagesse wisdom and understanding que tu nous les donnes au nom de Jésus. Grant unto us in the name of Jesus. Que nous ne manquons de rien au nom de Jésus. That we should not lack anything good. Que tu bénis nos efforts. That you bless our, que tu our bénis work. 
l'esprit de travail. And that you bless also the nous sommes tous nos papas qui n'ont pas de, de carrière. For those who don't have a job nous yet, prions au Père we pray, oh God, que tu trouves quelque chose pour nous au nom de Jésus. That you provide a job for them in the name of Jesus. Afin que nous continuions à participer dans ton service. So that we can continue to be a blessing dans ta mission. Work, in your work. Nous prions également. We, we pray, oh Lord. Et te confions. Et we, Cette we offrande ask, entre tes mains. Father, we bring this offering to et you. demandons, Père. And we pray que tu l'acceptes. That you accept the offering. Que tu le bénis. That you bless the offering. Que tu le bénis. Que tu bénis ceux là qui ont offert. And that you bless those who have given. Même ceux qui n'ont pas offert, Papa, bénis. Even them. those who have not given, bless them. Que tu les multiplies au centuple. Father, oh Lord, bless them. Afin que nous puissions l'utiliser pour ta gloire. Bless this so that we can Et use que seule la gloire te revienne. So that Au nom puissant your glory Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Père éternel, nous confions cette semaine entre tes Father, mains. Father, we commit this week into your hands. Et demander que tu sois au contrôle. And we pray that you be in control. Papa, précède nous. Father, go before us. Et que seule la gloire te revienne. And that glory be yours. Au nom puissant de Jesus. In the name of Jesus. J'ai prié. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Please, let's just take the few announcements that we have. Prenons ces quelques annonces. So that we can go home. Is there any first timer in the church today? Est-ce qu'il y a quelqu'un qui est là pour la première fois? Today is your first Sunday in this church. Quelqu'un qui est là pour la première fois? Is there anybody like that? Hallelujah. Right. Est-ce qu'il y a quelqu'un qui est là pour la première fois? No. All right, please let's listen to the few announcements. Alors écoutons ces quelques annonces. We're going to be having our midweek services as usual. Alors nous avons nos programmes de semaine qui continuent. Tuesday we meet at 7 p.m. Mardi 19h. For Bible study. Pour l'étude biblique. Please let's make it a point of duty to come. Alors essayons d'être là le mardi. We need to learn more from the Word of God. Nous devons apprendre davantage de la parole de Dieu. God is teaching us new new things every day. Et Dieu nous enseigne de nouvelles choses tous les jours. Tuesday 7 p.m. Mardi 19h. Let's come for Bible study. And we have talked about prayer today. On a parlé de la prière aujourd'hui. We need to be men. Oh, there is a first time are there? All right. Thank you, Jesus. All right. Ah, okay. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Bless you. God bless you. You are welcome in the name of the Lord. My sisters, you are welcome. Mes soeurs, vous êtes bienvenus. We thank God for your lives. Nous en merci à Dieu pour vos vies. I want to ask, did you enjoy the service? Est-ce que vous avez aimé le service? You enjoy the service? Vous avez aimé le service? Will you come next week? Est-ce que vous viendrez dimanche prochain? In Jesus' name, you will come. In Jesus' name, we, we want to thank God for your lives. And we thank God for what God brought you to receive today. In the name of Jesus Christ, you will be women of prayer. And as you pray, God will hear. Dieu va écouter and he will answer, et il va exaucer and shall be results, et il y aura des résultats the of Jesus. au nom de Jésus. We'll like you to please fill the form, S'il vous plaît, remplissez le formulaire. Put every information there, your phone number, your email address. Votre numéro, and you have a prayer request. Et si vous avez un sujet de prière, please put it there. Écrivez-le. So that the church can join you to pray. Et l'église va prier avec and vous. And you will see Vous aurez des résultats au nom de you, Jésus. Have your seat. Que Dieu vous bénisse pour vous asseoir. Thank you, Jesus. All right, so we have talked about prayer today. On a parlé de la prière aujourd'hui. And every Thursday we meet here to pray. Et tous les jeudis on se retrouve pour 7 prier. 7 p.m. we meet here to pray. À 19 heures. Please let's be here on Thursday. S'il vous plaît, soyons là jeudi. As we together lift our voices to God in prayer. Pour qu'ensemble on élève nos voix dans la prière. Remember one chasses a thousand. Souvenez-vous un chasse mille. There is a limit to which you can do alone. Et il y a une limite à laquelle vous pouvez faire seul. Two shall push to ten thousand to fly. Mais deux chasses. It's incredible. Chasse de chasse 10 000. The, 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 the power of corporate prayer. Le pouvoir de la prière collective. So let's be here on Thursday. Alors soyons là jeudi. 7 p.m. À 19 h The youth concert is finally here. Alors le concert des jeunes est là. Hallelujah. It comes up on Saturday. Ce sera samedi. On Saturday by the grace of God. Samedi par la grâce de Dieu. The, the details are on the screen and on the notice board. Les détails sont sur le tableau. Please don't allow the train to leave you behind. Alors ne laissez pas que le, le train vous laisse derrière. Don't allow the train to leave you behind. Que le, tra- le train ne vous laisse pas derrière. I said to the workers and ministers. Alors j'ai dit aux ouvriers aux ministres. If, don't, if we don't see you at the youth con- concert. Si on ne vous voit pas au concert des it jeunes. It means you are saying you are an old man. 
Ça veut dire que tu es un vieil homme. You are an old woman. Tu es une vieille femme. And we don't have any old man or old woman in this place. On n'a pas de vieille femme ni de vieil homme dans ce lieu. Nous sommes tous des jeunes. It's our program. It's for all of us. C'est notre programme. C'est pour nous. So we like to see everybody there. On voudrait voir tout le monde là-bas. The 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 guest artists are they will be they will be arriving. Les artistes invités vont arriver. Our youth themselves, they are loaded and they are they are they are ready for us on Saturday. Nos jeunes sont prêts pour nous samedi. So please let's be there. Alors soyons-y. Every one of us in Jesus Chacun name. Chacun d'entre nous au nom de Jésus. Hallelujah. Amen. And uh, the, 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 the president of the youth fellowship. Le président Brother du Raphael, groupe des jeunes, le frère Raphaël. Is still waiting for those of you who want to support them. Attend de ceux qui veulent le financially. Financièrement. Please see Brother Raphael. Voyez le frère Raphaël. So that you can be a blessing to the youth. Pour être une bénédiction pour les jeunes. Please all the students of the school of disciples. Alors tous les étudiants de l'école des disciples. I like to see you immediately after the service. Je vous vois immédiatement après le service. Students of the SOD, you know yourselves. Vous connaissez. Please see us immediately after the service. Voyez nous immédiatement après le service. The youth have a meeting after the service. Les jeunes ont une rencontre après le service. All the youth are Tous les jeunes doivent attendre. Wait behind. The women's prayer meeting holds after the service. La women of prayer, praise the Lord. Alleluia. Women of prayer, praise the Lord. Alleluia. Uh-huh. You have a prayer meeting after the service. Les the women. Une prière après le service. Please, the women are also to remember that they are to fast today.